Welcome to the Lakers News Today channel. Take the opportunity to leave that like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go to today's news. Can we just take a moment to reflect on the defensive struggles the Lakers have faced this season? It's been a rocky road, hasn't it? Even LeBron James himself couldn't help but acknowledge it. He dropped a hint that Dwight Howard's return could be the missing piece to fortify their defense. But alas, uncertainty looms over Dwight's status with the team. It's like he's slipped from their priority list, leaving fans scratching their heads. Off the court, whispers of concern surround Howard. Since his last stint with the Lakers, he's been on a roller coaster ride, including a detour to the National Superior Basketball League. Sure, his offensive prowess might not be what it once was, but let's not forget, at 38, he's still a beast on the boards. The man's got energy for days and a burning desire to keep playing in the NBA. But the big question remains, are teams willing to take a gamble on him? So here we are, Lakers fans, at a crossroads. Should the Lakers reconsider Howard's role? It's a conundrum worth pondering. But beyond the stats and the court, Howard's journey with the Lakers was more than just basketball, it was about growth, both personally and professionally. Now, as the Lakers strive for glory once again, his potential return carries a weighty significance. It's about redemption, forgiveness, and the powerful notion of second chances. Are you buzzing with excitement at the prospect of Howard's comeback, or do you find yourself still teetering on the fence? I'm eager to hear your take on this pivotal moment for the Lakers. Let's dive into the discussion together. What's your opinion on the possible return of Dwight Howard? At this crucial stage of the season, the Lakers' chances of finishing in the top six of the Western Conference are becoming increasingly elusive. Sitting in ninth place, three games away from the eighth-placed Phoenix Suns, it appears the team's fate is more aligned with their quest for a spot in the play-in tournament. However, there is no time for discouragement. The Lakers need to keep fighting in each game, as even the possibility of being overtaken by the Houston Rockets currently in 11th place, is a potential reality. The Rockets are on an impressive six-game winning streak, the second longest in the NBA at the moment, showcasing a formidable combination of solid defense and a surging offense. During this period, they overcame challenges such as the Sacramento Kings and Cleveland Cavaliers, demonstrating unwavering determination. It's important to note that the Rockets, with a 33-35 record, are just 3.5 games behind the Lakers, who have a 37-32 record. With the series of regular season matches tied, the tiebreaker would be decided by performance against teams from the Western Conference. In this regard, the Rockets have the advantage, with an impressive 22-19 against their conference opponents, while the Lakers have a 24-23 record. The Lakers can't afford to relax. They need to keep their eyes open not only to secure a favorable play-in position, but also to hold their position in the face of the growing threat posed by the Rockets. This is a testing time for the Lakers' resilience and resolve. Can they ensure their survival in this fierce battle? What is your perspective on this tight race? Do the Lakers have what it takes to overcome this challenge?